Yo guys, what's good, man? It's your boy Dre. Welcome back to another lit banger. Welcome back to another lit video, all right? I will be doing another washing style, but this time my hair is super, super, super short. And I got a haircut, I believe, Monday I got a haircut, so my hair is really short right now, as you guys can see. Um, so, for all you short hair wearers out there who wants to do washing styles, only thing I use is just a medium hard brush, that's it, all right? I don't use a soft brush. I don't use a straight hard brush. I just use a medium hard brush. Now this is a brand new brush that I, you know, just opened out of the pack. Pretty dope. It says shark on it. Pretty dope. Um, it's straight, medium, and hard. So for all you medium wavers, you know what I'm saying, or short hair wavers, don't use a hard brush. Just use a medium hard or a medium brush. You know what I'm saying? So you don't be hurting your scalp. You don't be pulling your hair. You know what I'm saying? So what we're gonna do is, you guys already know what we're gonna do. I have to fill this water bottle up with water because there's no water in it so let me let me fill this up real quick you know all right so now that we have filled this up get you a water bottle get a water bottle and um fill it up with water so you can spray your hair so i did wash my hair so this is the second time i'm gonna wash it today right so i have to take my water water bottle and i have to spray it i have to you know, dap it up just a little bit, you know? So this is for like people with like short hair, you know what I'm saying? Don't use a hard brush, just use a medium, you know? No hard brush, just a medium. You don't wanna, you don't wanna hurt your hair, all right? So now that we have done that, um, I like to take my, I like to take my uh, conditioner. This is my conditioner, I like to use Tresemme. Um, I like it, it curl hydrates pretty good for my hair, so I don't know, it may be good for you guys' hair, so if you guys wanna try this out, go ahead and try it out, but this conditioner, I like it. So I simply just, real easy, you know, just simply just open it and then spread it all over my hair. Now I don't have my mirror, I broke it yesterday, so I'm gonna try my best to try and be in the angle with this. So we're gonna put a little bit on it. You know, put a little bit on it around it. Now our our hair is already wet. Okay, our hair is already wet. Now that um I put that in it, spray it just a little bit more. All right. Um, put like a towel down. You know what I'm saying? I don't want that water to. All right. So now that we have done that, um, sweat the brush. Wet the brush. All right. Now this is a brand new brush. I have not opened it. I have not used it. So very simple. Just you know, this is conditioner. I'm going with conditioner first. So let's brush the conditioner up in there real quick. Now this is a medium hard. All right. Um, it's gonna go, it's gonna soften up a little bit. So that's why I said you guys use like a medium brush or a medium hard. You know. So this is the uh, conditioner I'm using. The conditioner basically softens your hair. You know, it makes your hair move like really good. You know, like it, it just makes it soft. So if you're brushing your hair, you won't be struggling trying to, you know, get it to go in a certain direction because it makes it very soft. All right, so put a little bit more up in there. Spray a little bit more. All right, so this is what I do all the time for my washing style. Just do this. Now I advise you guys to do this because this, it works very good, like. This is how you guys better your 360 ways. This is how you guys break forks. This is how you guys, you know, make the connections. Now I don't need a mirror because I know how my angles are. But if you guys don't know your angles, make sure you use a mirror. Like I love this. I love these brushes right here. If you have a chance to get a hold of a brush like this with the handles on the side, you can just grip it. I advise you guys to get one. Alright, they are the best. So now that we have brushed our conditioner in, our hair is, you know, soft, it's smooth, right? Um, now, you don't want to use a hard brush for the million times because it will hurt your scalp while you are using this, this um, conditioner and because the conditioner softens your hair. So now that that's, that's done, I like to take my my shampoo, all right? And I have my conditioner in, all right? I spray a little bit more. Now, why I spray it a lot more? Because we have coarse hair. Our hair gets dry, and we want to keep it, you know, wet, you know what I'm saying, damped. So when we put the shampoo in, 
put it all over. Now this is gonna create more soap than the uh, conditioner did. So same thing, we're gonna take our, our the same brush, and we're gonna brush. So this is gonna, this is gonna create more, more soap. So whenever you wash your style, you could do this in the shower, you could do it outside the shower, you know. Now, I've already washed my hair already, so this is the second time I'm doing it with, with the brush this time. I know you guys are wondering like, oh, should you brush 10 times this, this side, 10 times this side? If you want, it's up to you, all right? So if you want to do 10 back here, you can do 10. And then you want to do 10 on the side. It's up to you, you know, if you're here. And then brush it on this side. You got the top. See, it's been very simple, just like that, man. So now you guys see, I'm just using the same brush and my hair is, is, you guys see the waves already coming in? The waves are already coming in. I don't even have a mirror, bro, and I'm trying to, you know, focus. So if you don't know your angles, get you a mirror, figure out your angles, and brush. Because you don't want to be brushing your hair in a certain direction, and then your hair just comes out how you don't want it. You know what I'm saying? So, um, let's get the sides, let's get the top. Now, you don't got to be doing this all day. You know, 20 minutes is cool, 25 minutes is cool, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get to the back. I don't know if you guys can see the back, but the back is straight down, straight down, right? And then you got this back corner, straight down, and then you have the side. And then you have the top, and then you have this back corner. Then you have the side, then you have the top. Just like that. But some of you guys' hair grows different, so you gotta figure that out. So this is how my hair is looking, my waves is looking. Let's put a little bit more water in it. That's all it is, bro, it's real simple, you know. Hopefully you guys are doing good with your hair. Hope you guys are wavy. Hope you guys are staying safe, you know. I know it's been a week since I've uploaded, but this quarantine is driving me crazy, not being able to Go places, doing what you want to do. You got to be stuck in the house. You know, a lot of places being closed at 8 p.m. It just, it's, it sucks. You know what I'm saying? Kind of depressing. So, to make up for that, we'll bring you on a cool little washing style real quick. Now, after you guys are done with this, right? Let me put a little bit more shampoo and then I'm going to brush a few more times. And then, I'm going to put my do-rag on and then I'm going to wash it out. And I'm pretty sure you guys already know the outcome of it, right? All right, boom. Now, why I have this towel around my, my neck is because just in case the water drips or in case a lot of soap gets around my brush, I could just simply wash it off, you know? Be prepared, bro. Be prepared. Now, let's spray a little bit more water. Boom. Now, bro, look at my hair. It looks dark, right? L looking good. Looking pretty good. Oh yes. It's looking pretty, pretty good. Got the back straight down. Corner diagonal. Side diagonal. Top straight down. Now, I don't have my mirror, so I can't focus on my crown, but let's go to the other side real quick. Back straight down. Back corner diagonal. Side, top. Just like that. So, now that that's done, boom. You know, we already did everything. Got our soap in. 
right behind the ears, your face. I like to take my do-rag, a silky do-rag. Take a silky do-rag, all right? It's your nice silky do-rag, right? Throw it on, boom. And you guys probably say, oh, you, have, you still have the soap in here, rinse it off. Well, that's what we're gonna do. Once I put my do-rag on, we're gonna rinse it off. So the reason why I do this is because my hair is still laid down. I have the soap in, so when I rinse it out, my hair will continue to be laid down. And then as I rinse the soap out, over time, my hair will dry up. And if you want, you can take your little pomade or butter, oil, whatever you have, put it in there a little bit, put the bag over it, brush it, put the durag, you're ready to go. Simple as that. All right, boom. Let's tie it. You don't want to tie it too hard because when you have a wet do-rag and then your do-rag is tied super hard, then it's going to make a big line on your forehead and it's going to look ugly. Because the other day I, I did that, um, my do-rag was still wet, drying, and then I tied it super hard and then my forehead had like a big super line. It was super ugly. So we hold the top, pull the back down, pull the sides down. You don't want to stick any hairs up when you're pulling your do-rag down, you know what I'm saying? Then we're gonna fix, we're gonna fix the top. I mean, we're gonna fix the front. I know my do I probably kinda, kinda crooked right now cause I just put it on any kind of way, but it's all good, you know what I'm saying? It's all good. We only gonna wear it for a little bit. And then we're just gonna wash it out. We're gonna wash it out. I'm gonna show you guys how I do that. So, I'll be right back. All right, y'all, so just like that, I just rinsed my hair off. Um, rinsed out all the shampoo. All the shampoo is rinsed off, so now what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna let my hair dry for about like an hour. Let it all dry, let all the soap come out. I mean, let all the water, you know, dry out. And then I'm gonna take it off, and then we're just gonna, you know, put the bag over it and Put our little products in, whatever you want to put in. Usually I don't put any products, but depending on how dry it is, I'll put like a little bit of butter in it. A little bit of butter, just, you know, and then put the bag over it and then brush it. The soft brush, and that's about it. So, um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Really appreciate it. If you guys want to see what it looks like afterwards. I already have a washer style video and showing you guys how it looks afterwards. But if you guys want to see what it looks afterwards with short hair, let's get this video to 300 likes. And I will do that for you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, it's your boy Drake. If you ain't brushing, I'm brushing. Peace.